Chris, the Entertainment Man Bisco, and you're watching Bringing Back the Entertainment Man Talk Show, Pre-Toronto Islands Part 2. Now, what, I got three questions here, randomly picked by our fans out there. For those fans who sent that in, thank you so much for sending in. You guys want to keep sending in your questions? Send me a message at chrisbiscoe.tvpt at gmail.com if you want to send in your questions about the uh, video project team. Or you can go to our blog tv, www.blogtv.com slash people slash the tvpt channel. We have a talk show on Friday nights, 8 p.m. Eastern Time, 6 p.m. Central, uh, sorry, Mountain Time, that is uh, 5 p.m. Pacific Time, and that is 7 p.m. Central Time. If you want to watch that, go there and listen in. So what do you expect with tomorrow's trip? Well, tomorrow, I expect to have fun, of course. This is why I picked out a great day. It's going to be nice weather. It's going to be uh, windy a little bit, so we'll have the wind cut on some of the camera. Whatever is not windy, we'll be using the digital but if we use that, our regular video camera, we'll be doing it with that one. I'll be bringing the microphone. I'll be bringing a lot of the equipment. So that's what I am expecting tomorrow is to have fun. Go out there, enjoy myself, show you what's all about the Toronto Island. Just to let you know, we are doing it in two parts. Um, next, this year we're doing it uh, Highlands to Center. Next year we'll be doing it Center to Warts. And then probably the following year we'll be doing like a harbor front uh, tour and maybe some c &E, uh, exhibition place uh, filming a little bit and maybe eventually go up to Castle Loma, do some filming up there, do some uh, theaters around the Toronto area. We hope to do that in the future. That'll be a lot of fun. Get the right to TTC. I'll do videos on the TTC as well. You know you guys probably would love to see that. Um, what kind of old methods are you using tomorrow? Well, let me come down. I'm going to come down off my pedestal here. My bag, you see? Oh, there goes my bag. There goes my bag. Really? My uh, wrap up time, when the time to wrap up for the show. Brent will hold this up, then it's time to wrap up. Or when it's time for commercial, which is every. It sits on the back here, it sits on each side. It's a six to seven minute marker. of the show will be the first commercial break and then every six to seven minutes after so it'll be like seven, 14, 21, 28, so on, so, so on, so on, so on, so on. I will actually put in, like I'll write a little sheet for them and I'll put in a time limit for each. When it's time to wrap up it's about 21 minute marker but because tomorrow is the Toronto Islands We'll be doing one hour, maybe 45 minutes, depending how long we have a lot to talk about on the island. So we're going to be looking at that. That's one method. Put that back in my my uh, bin. Also, we have our stopwatch, which I don't know if Brent or myself will be using it. So we'll say we're recording now. So then we will uh, actually... Let's record it, so every 7 minutes and it'll say cut, like we'll cut it, and then we'll pause the, the timer. I might actually hold it in my hand, like my left hand, or I might put it in my pocket, and when it's time to get cold, you will maybe give me like a hand signal or something, we'll figure something out for a hand signal, I'll put that on a sheet too, and you will either like maybe wave his arms or or give me like two minutes, like two fingers, two minutes, one minute, to, and then like three, like a three and a zero, I mean 30 seconds. I will know that the difference. So that's what, another thing we use that is really handy for the filmings, for the entertainment talk show and on other locations like this we do in the past. What kind of theme is this event that we'll have or that that have or has not been used uh, tomorrow. Well, the theme tomorrow is bringing back the Entertainment Man Talk Show, meaning we're going to make Toronto aware that we have a show called the Entertainment Man Talk Show, and it's coming back next year. And we're going to have flyers to hand out to you guys. 
We're going to be handing out flyers. We have about maybe 50 to 75, maybe 100, 150 flyers left in our stock. So, uh, that's one thing we're going to be using is, uh, it's going to be making aware of our team in Toronto that we actually exist in Durham region and maybe get people aware and uh, hand up flyers. I love to talk to them. If they want to come in front of camera, I will. I won't. Pre if they want me to credit them, uh, then I can put a credit in, saying they uh, come in. I'll just introduce them and say who this this is. But uh, otherwise, I'll be out there promoting the group and filming and having a good time. And that's about it for this part two. Thank you for listening, and we'll see you in a bit for part three.